But we're gonna have to do this kind of quick. Number one, I'm really hungry too. I'm really cold. Three, this video is kind of long overdue. I'm really surprised I haven't seen anybody else do this. So today's topic is getting offended. Um, how should I start this? People have the right to say what they want. They can say what they want, however they want. It is their job, especially in America. We have the freedom of speech. And if we're getting restricted because of what other people think, then what's the point in having freedom of speech? If I say I like Taylor Swift more than I like My Chemical Romance, or I like One Direction more than My Chemical Romance, then I'm gonna start a shitstorm on the internet. I, I try on MCR, but it doesn't work for me. I'm sorry, I try. I really did try. I have my own opinions, and I have the right to those, and you have the right to your opinions. However, you cannot yell at me for my own opinion. If someone says something that offends you, they do not have to apologize. You know, this is the part where I want to get a little touchy, but you're the one who chose to get offended. You have the right to choose how you act. Getting offended is an action, and so you have the right to choose what you get offended to. If you get offended to me saying One Direction is better than MCR, then I'm not going to apologize because it's not my fault you're offended. You're the one who chose it. Like, if someone were to come up to me and say, I don't like Taylor Swift's music, then I'm like, congratulations. I thank you for your opinion. I, you know, I like Taylor Swift. I like One Direction, but I also like, you know, Fall Out Boy and Panic. And If someone says something that offends you, it is not their job to forgive. You need to sit down and think, why did this offend me? Why did so when something said offend me you know if it's something they purposely said to make you mad then i give you all right to retaliate however if they say something innocently or they say something and not realize it could be offensive then don't point it out don't ask them to apologize because they didn't realize it at the time they might have a perfectly good reason for saying what they said and there might have been a backstory but if you just heard that one part and you get offended that's not their problem that is not their problem. That is your fault. And most of the time people don't want to offend you. Like most YouTubers don't want to offend you by saying something. They don't, you know, want to make you mad. They want you to like them. However, if you guys keep getting offended and saying that they're shit for a certain opinion they have, or they're a terrible person because of an opinion they have, then they have full right to get mad at you. I give them full right. You just have to learn how to get over it. You just have to learn how to not get offended. Getting offended, it's something in every human, everyone does it. I get offended a lot. I mean, some of the things people say to me, and I'll try to go in defense of what I believe. However, I've just learned that, you know, some people just don't realize what they're saying or that it is offensive, or some people just don't care. I'm leaning towards the whole, I just need to stop caring about what other people think because you know what, I can't control their thoughts. I can't control what they do. If they want to get offended, then they can get offended. That's just wasted energy on your part. <laughs> Basically, think before you speak. However, if someone gets offended, don't take personal responsibility because it's not your fault if you offend someone. It's their fault for choosing to get offended. How do you get over being offended though? Like how do you overcome that natural urge to have everything attack you personal and the world is attacking you? What I do is I tend to think big world, big picture. If someone says they don't like Taylor Swift and I'm wearing a Taylor Swift shirt that day, well, if they don't like them, they don't like them. Like if someone insults my religion and tries to offend me with that, I actually try to go along with it. If they, someone says that Mormons are weird, you know what? I, I, I'd actually have to agree with that one. Mormons are pretty weird. If someone wants to offend me, they can try their best. I'm probably not gonna get offended very easily. The only way I ever get offended is if someone doesn't listen to me or doesn't listen to my argument. Because usually I'm the person in the back that's hiding, but once I say something, I want people to listen. We're in the process of moving, so I don't know if I'll get another video up in the next couple weeks or not. Depends on Wi-Fi issues, but I will try my best. Anywho, um, I'm gonna go pack some stuff and I'm going to go lay on the floor because I have like 18 days till I graduate and I'm not prepared. It's exactly a month till Tiffios. I'm not prepared for that one either. I'm scared. Oh, and I started this thing where every time I burp, I s ask people while I'm single. Yeah, it's it's a good time. I highly suggest it. Bye.